guys welcome back to another video today i'm gonna do a catfish 101 video how to do a very simple easy makeup look use any kind of moisturizer creams that has some sort of spf i'm a massive massive fan on ole products so i use ole and i use a lot of l'oreal skincare products a very generous amount literally everywhere what you'll need to do obviously is moisturize your face you need to literally make sure you moisturize your face please make sure when you're moisturizing your face i know we've all done it be gentle with your skin guys because trust me when you get to my age you'll know exactly what i'm talking about i moisturize really well um i'll stop but me being me I use my rose hip oil as well this is what i use i normally use this just on my skin sometimes on the night before I'll just apply it all over my face, all over. skin is ready. It's a wet and wild um, soft beige foundation. This foundation is so nice. The fact that I've moisturized my face, I've applied oil, just look how the foundation is gliding onto my skin. This always, always gives such a um, flawless cover for my skin. So. And also, if you've got really, really dry skin, this is kind of method that you should be doing. Revolution Makeup um, Concealer in C6. And I'm going to add that on top. Right. And I let it set for a little bit. And what I'll do at the same time is the Collections Brow Kit Bar. And I use the center shade and if you guys watch my Eid look this is exactly what I use I use a brow kit palette to create that smoky eye look that I did um, and I'm just gonna very lightly my eyebrows at the moment I'm currently growing them so they are super thick so I have to be really careful is to not overfill because to be honest my eyebrows don't need filling at all I just need to use a brow gel um, and run a mascara through it and it, I'm good to go basically so I'm using like a stippling technique just patting 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 but this is what I always have done in with my air spun powder because it's a cheaper alternative to use to bake every single day rather than my favorite all-time favorite which is Laura Mercier I'll get like a big brush like this and I'll grab my favorite Matte Maker by Maybelline, which I have hit pan on, and this I think is ivory. No, it's classic ivory, yeah. And I will literally get as much products as I can, wipe it off, and then I'll just dust this all over my skin, basically. Guys, I have been recently using, and I have been using, I think it's one, two, which shades I normally use? Oh, uh, yeah, I use these three shades here. They're my everyday thing, guys. This is how I quickly slap my face on. It literally just bronze the hell out of my face. So I'm just looking straight ahead. And I'm just gonna basically just bronze the whole of my neck. Now, if you do end up going a bit too crazy like I have done, the brush that I would normally bake with, I would just use it to clean everything up. Obviously my eyes look a little bit dead, so I'll just get any brush that I can get. It could be any sort of blending brush um, and I'll go in with the darkest shade. So this is how I use all of my products, quite versatile. Palette by BH and I'm just gonna literally place it all over my lid. Just to add a wash of colour, that is it guys. That is it, that's all I'm gonna do, a wash of colour all over my eyes. I'm gonna get the thin side, thinner side, and I'm gonna do the bottom. And I always contour under my lips. Right, that is it. I'll get the same brush, and I'm using the BH Cosmetic Palette. With this one, you have to be super care careful. I'm using the banana powder, it's quite bright, this, so you don't wanna overpower it. Just literally a tap. And just brighten the under eye. Whatever you got left, just clean up your forehead if you think you've overpowered it with bronzer, your chin, anywhere that you feel like you've gone a bit too cray cray. I've kind of started using castor oil on my eyes again, so hopefully 
I'm gonna slowly, slowly get my eyelashes back because I used to always have really nice long eyelashes, really thick eyelashes everywhere that I went. People were like, oh my god, you got your eyelashes on, like, yes, honey. So I absolutely love this mascara. This is by the Kiko Milano. It's the gold, gold wave collection, I think. Oh, I think it comes. They look so right, you know, look so right, so right. So what I'm gonna do next, I'm gonna apply some lip sticky. So I normally stick to nudes. I really just stick to nudes, guys, when it comes to work. I do wear reds, believe it or not. Um, should I put red on for today? Yep, I'll put red on today. So I'm gonna go in with my Rizika Cosmetics uh, Ferrari Reddish. Use the MAC lip liner in Brook. In most cases, I don't ever use a lip liner, but I am gonna in this case because I am wearing red. Right, the bottom lips are done. And with my lips, guys, I have a very nice natural cupid's bow, and I just follow the natural lines. And I'm going slowly over. It's quite difficult when you're trying to talk, guys, but I'm going to show you the difference in a second. For starters, you need to make sure you're freaking sharp on your lip line, lip liners, because otherwise it's just going to end up with a hot mess. So I'm going to show you very close up of what it looks like if you were to lip line the way I lip line, because I do overline. So that's my cupid's bow is very natural. This is God's given. Thank you very much and I go over and I basically go around so it kind of gives you a bit of that natural power. You have to be super careful with the red and not to over overline because then you're just going to look like a clown and it's going to look stupid and very unnatural. Um, then I'm going to go in with my gorgeous Ferrari Reddish uh, 801 by Rizika Cosmetics. This is a such a gorgeous shade guys it's absolutely gorgeous this was actually sent to me by them it's not a sponsored video by them I'm not getting paid to talk about their products they simply sent me their products and I absolutely love this red and I myself need to remind myself is to make sure I keep my liquid lipstick within my lines my lip line shape that I've created because sometimes I end up going over which is defeats the purpose and then I end up looking like what's she called Miranda that like, legit but anyway now all I need to do girls is get my favorite I am not a big fan of the sports spray because I do believe the sports spray has really messed up my skin I'm loving this glow fix by uh, Revolution Makeup Pro, you just need to make sure you really, really shake this quite well. Let's sit my face. Yes, I do spray quite a lot. Let's just use the Huda Beauty. So you need to make sure you really fan it out, guys, because if you're going to spray the way I spray, guarantee you're going to end up with drips. So you need to make sure you really set that spray layer on top in order for your foundation to stay on all day. Make sure you wipe off all of your makeup from your tops, guys. My hair is going to stay like this. I literally woke up like this. Uh, my hair doesn't get touched at all, guys. Check if your lips are clean, not your lipsy teeth. Oh, I need to clean that up. Towards the end, I know I've sprayed my freaking face. I grab the um, contour palette that I use on my eyes. And normally by the time you do everything else before you set your face, um, the smudge that you get with the mascara tends to just crumble off. And I just end up going over my eyes just to darken them up for the final time because sometimes when you spray over your eyes guys you do lose some colour so if you do set your face and you have done a really nice eye makeup just avoid setting that area up just make sure you get the rest of your skin but avoid your eyes 
because you can lose that color that you've applied on your eyes but obviously if you're doing it an everyday simple look like this then it doesn't matter that's my everyday simple easy peasy lemon squeezy look so i shall see you guys on my next video make sure you hit that like button subscribe comment and share and definitely hit that bell notification because then you'll get notified when i upload and i am gonna try my very best to upload daily guys i'm not gonna make any promises i'm just gonna upload daily so i shall see you guys in my next video bye i keep forgetting I keep forgetting to say stay beautiful, that's my life. So make sure you stay beautiful.